and Jack Redshaw calmly made it 2-1. It was also the weekend, really, Appington, wasn't it? And Paul Cook would know you shouldn't underestimate Appington Stanley, but it didn't seem to get through to his players. He didn't have to, after the game, he said just that. Yeah. People just think Appington are what they are, a little tiny club with, with no ambitions and no hope. And they're far from that. And I think you're right, look across the Football League, all the results this weekend. Appington, no one would have given Appington a chance of beating high flying Chesterfield. And yet they were 3 0 up, weren't they, with Lee, Lee Molyneux's hat trick? Great hat trick. He, he does come with baggage, uh, but if he concentrates on his football yeah. like this and yeah. scores hat tricks like this, Valuable player. It's, well, the goal kind of poachers goals as well. Certainly, the, the, the second one is with the, with the penalty. There's not many players that do follow in like this, but it's, it's about being in the right place at the right time. And he's he's Johnny on the spot, isn't he? And that's why he scores again. He appreciates this this pass from Sam Morse. It's a really poor square ball, but he's, he's onto it in a flash and it put more it puts Appleton in the driving seat. Yeah, fighting for their lives. Mm. Uh, I